Hey YouTube, here's a quick video on the things that you can do with Kodi Remote app. So I'll be using the uh, Kodi Remote app which is available in Android to, to my Kodi media player of course. Uh, Kodi or formerly XBMC is a very great uh, media player. It has a lot of uh, customizable features and the good thing about this is you can use an Android app um, through your smartphone to control the features of this Kodi Remote Player. So let's get right into it. So uh, first, um, you have to uh, connect your Kodi Remote uh, Player um, to to your Kodi Media Player. Uh, the the first requirement is your smartphone or tablet um, and your media player uh, should be in one one network. Uh, if you're connected uh, through a Wi-Fi, well, you must you must uh, connect uh, through the same router or same network connection, so that your um, your your Kodi Remote app and uh, media player will uh, will uh, get detected. So first, I open the Kodi Remote app, and on the upper left corner, there's a menu there. In order for you to set it up, you have to to set it up like this um, you need a sort of name on the top and you need to put in the IP address of your of your Kodi media player uh, the 88 is the port uh, XBMC is just the username but you can put any name and of course a password now at the bottom for the advanced configuration you can just leave it blank uh, for the default uh, setting so in, in my end, I've already um, configured it. If you click on test, you will see on your um, Kodi uh, media player that uh, the, the core remote was detected. Now, if you go back and click on remote, so this is a very handy uh, remote uh, app. You can uh, browse um, through the feature features or options like uh, if if I click on appearance and then click the, the one on the um, uh, center you can configure based on what you need this part is uh, for going back or return from here you can um, you can control the different categories on your Kodi remote uh, remote uh, um, app like weather, pictures, videos, movies, TV shows, music, programs, and system. Here at the bottom, you can also go to the home menu. And if you click um, this one, that's for the movie. You can use the remote to browse the different movies that are saved on your uh, application. Um, this one is for, for the uh, TV series that are saved and for the music and for the pictures if i browse the uh, pictures folder that i've saved previously i can browse the different um, uh, the different pictures uh, picture folders where i save my pictures to all right and if i click on the home we'll go back to the home menu and uh, again uh, browse to the different categories um, categories of the uh, application if I click on the menu again and then click movies it would go to the movies um, as you can see instead of uh, browsing the movies on your screen or the application you can browse through the different um, movies that are saved on your application um, you can you'll see a, a an icon and uh, um, you will see the description of the movie that are saved if you click on TV shows um, it's the same so I have these are the TV shows that are saved and if you click on music the same goes and for the files so these are the folders that I have saved in the application and even the add-ons the add-ons you can um, you can control the add-ons uh, using your uh, remote control and uh, it has the settings if 
you go back you can click the you can click click this one to go to the um, to the application uh, uh, remote view so basically that's it uh, this is these are the things that I can do with the Kodi remote app um, it, it's very handy it it is a feature rich um, instead of uh, using your uh, let's say if it's a home chatter PC instead of using your your mouse you can just use this remote control to control everything on your on your uh, Kodi app and um, uh, basically um, um, make uh, configuration settings or play a movie you can even uh, search a particular movie like um, let's say uh, 2012 movie and then when you click search or let's say uh, we can search a um, a movie let's say internship internship there okay so basically that's it uh, those are the things that you can do with this uh, Kodi uh, remote app um, you can try to download it if you're using a a um, um, a Kodi uh, media player so that's it uh, please subscribe to my youtube channel so you could get updates on videos i'm regularly uploading every week thank you bye bye